Little issues can really add up to big trouble. That's exactly what happened recently for two Valley restaurants. It is a double dose of problems in tonight's Dirty Dining Report. Hi there. Hi, we're with Channel 13. We're back. We're seeing some of the same problems from the last time we paid a visit to Bamboo Desserts and Drinks on West Spring Mountain near Decatur. Contact 13 stopped by last June after Bamboo was shut down by inspectors. This time they were slapped with a 39 demerit C grade. You guys, yeah. you're having some issues here. What's yeah. going on? One of the repeat offenses is hand washing. The recent Southern Nevada Health District inspection found one employee not washing his hands before handling food. But the manager says they're taking steps to prevent future mistakes. We're just going to change and we're working with the health department. They're going to help us uh, do what's right. And, and train maybe some yeah, employees? Yeah, yeah, we're going to train the employee and we're going to hire a health consultant. We also asked about some of the other recent violations. Food like these beans sitting out at the wrong temperature, plus expired food in the walk-in refrigerator. The thing is, I bought the milk the day before and I didn't check the uh, expiration date and they came the day after and yeah, they, it was expired. Utensils were also found sitting in dirty water and the inspection report says employees were using reusable containers without cleaning them first. The reusable container were just caps. So we didn't, we're not actually serving it. We're just like capping it and put it away. Then we do, we do serve it, we use re, uh, new caps, but we're, uh, we're just gonna throw out that rule and we just use new everything from now on. Another spot in our dirty dining report this week is Brutus Island style restaurant on South Rainbow in Sahara. It was also hit with a 39 demerit C grade. Hi there, we're with Channel 13. Inspectors say employees weren't properly washing their hands. Food was found sitting out at unsafe temperatures, like this sour cream and salsa. There was a pink slimy buildup on the ice machine, plus overall problems with cleanliness, like severely worn cutting boards, extremely dirty grease hoods, and excessive buildup on the grill. You guys got written up for a lot of different things here. The restaurant's founder spoke with us by phone and says he's addressed all the issues and made all necessary repairs. There's also one recent closure to tell you about. Los Mocajeres on Northeastern and Owens was shut down for gross unsanitary conditions. The health district tells us they've been reinspected and now have a zero demerit A grade. Bamboo desserts and drinks and Brothers Island style restaurant have not been reinspected just yet. Well, a 